what do we do with the person who comes number two? Mm. And I fully agree with the president that it's time we start these discussions. Okay. And uh, how, how are we going to do it together? But I will go further than what the president is saying. Okay. Uh, at the time that I was making that argument, there were no governors. Mm. Yeah? We only had a president. But now we have governors. What do we do with the number two in the county elections? Mm. We need also to have a strong person, an equal, who can also uh, serve as an opposition leader within the county. I'm telling you, mm. what the president is saying there, that the leader of opposition will help in terms of the governance, mm. will apply equally to the, 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 the leader of opposition in the, at the county level. Why I say so is that... Uh, because it's an interesting perspective you hold. Yes. That would mean expanding more, especially though that would mean 48 um, uh, leaders of opposition, if you do the 47 counties and then the... The, the national one. Uh -huh. Yeah, but um, I have envisaged this way, okay. that uh, we create a special seat mm. for the leader of opposition in, the, in, in, in Kenya, now at the national government. Mm. He should sit in the... or she should sit mm in the National, National Assembly, Assembly. Yes. and then the running mate should have a seat in the Senate, Senate. so okay. that they can both lead check. the charge from both sides mm. uh, of the House. And then in the counties, I have argued a special seat should be created. Now, this person who is in the county should be you know, having some perks that make him higher than, uh, uh, than, uh, than an ordinary MCA. Okay. But it shouldn't be anything equal to what the governor mm. uh, has, so that there is a clear distinction. But they will play a very good role. Why I say so, mm. remember uh, Buana George. Yes. Today, if you met your classmate mm -hmm. anywhere, even outside, you're having tea somewhere, mm -hmm. your classmate can tell you anything because you played football with him, you, you ran around, you fell when you were young, yes. and he can say anything to you because you're at the same level. Yeah. You know, in a sense, you share a same level. Mm. So the same thing, if you ran for governor and you lost to someone narrowly or with a margin, he is your peer. In a sense, he can tell you anything. Mm -hmm. If you ran for president and lost to someone, you can tell that person anything. And uh, th this is the only person, because your classmate <laughs> cannot maybe address me in the manner he will address you. Why? Because I'm older. I'm, you know, other factors come into, into play. Into play yes. But if you ran the same race with a person, mm -hmm and that person becomes a president, you become a runners-up, mm. you can talk to him in a, di in a sense that nobody else can. Yeah. So I think we, we need to accommodate this, this, uh, these offices, mm. not just where the president is talking about. I think we also need to find a way to create that position in the county level, okay. so that the two levels of government have those positions. And I want to talk about something else, uh, Buana yeah. George. Mm -hmm. We will, we, we, yeah, we, we, we will talk about that. Yeah. Uh, then, then the, you know, be, be, before we head shortly into a break. Yeah. So that would that then uh, premise yeah, the creation of these, uh, you know, offices yeah. or seats yeah. under, you know, Article Two Fifty Five. That is the amending of the Constitution. Are yes. we staring at, an, at another constitutional moment? I think so. Um, I think so. But Constitution, like you know, mm. <laughs> it's a very it's a very tricky thing. Mm. There must be consensus on both sides. Okay. And the unfortunate thing is that uh, the opposition in this country mm. did not capture the moment. When the letter of the president landed, the first people to say no were the people in opposition. Mm. And it shocked me because I'm wondering what is better? Is it uh, walking in the streets, uh, throwing stones, or is it coming to engage on policy mm. on the ground without disturbing Wanjiko outside? Mm. You know, on the uh, hallowed ground of parliament, on the hallowed ground of the Senate, 
or is it better to be outside there throwing stones? Mm. So I was shocked. So as of now, there is no consensus in terms of creation of that office. Some have attacked it on the legal basis that, uh, you know, the president cannot start this. That is why it failed the previous uh, attempts and so on. But the concept is there. It must be there that uh, we need to have opposition. And there are many reasons. Mm -hmm. And people think that opposition is a bad thing. Some people think we are talking badly. No. Let me tell you, mm. there's the concept of loyal opposition. Okay. Yeah? Loyal opposition doesn't mean that you support the government. No. Mm. In Britain, you have the, 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 the king, who is the head of state. Yeah? And then you have the head of government, who is the prime minister. Yes. And then you have loyal opposition. Loyal to who? Not the prime minister, not to the head of government, but loyal to the state, which is headed by the king. Mm. So you have, it's very clear in, in, that, in that country. Mm. But in Kenya, after independence, uh, Jomo Kenyatta combined the prime ministership with the presidency. So the head of state is also the head of government. So sometimes it looks, it's a bit blurred. Mm. You would be, you'd be looking like you are, you are attacking the state. But in fact, opposition, is supposed to be loyal to the state, yeah. not necessarily what the government is saying. Indeed. Yeah, so loyal to the people of Kenya. Uh -huh. yeah. Absolutely, and it is that point that we, should, we take a short break right here on Daily Report. When we come back, we still continue to demystify a few issues in the Constitution.